Well, when we assess physical activity, historically, we've tended to concentrate on those things that are easiest to remember. And those are things like going to the gym or doing recreational activity or what we do in work. But actually, physical activity is something we spend the entire day doing. And as the amount of activity we do in work and recreation declines, the other forms of activity like domestic activity and, and transportation become increasingly important. And they're very difficult to assess just by asking people questions because none of us really carry around in our head an idea of how far we walk each day. We know whether we walk to work, we know whether we walk at work, and we know whether we walk for recreation. But we don't carry around a notion of totality of activity. And really this, uh, this leads us down a road of being very clear about why we want to measure physical activity and for what purpose. And really what we need to be doing is developing tools that are specific for that purpose. And that might be assessing the prevalence of inactivity, uh, documenting the association of activity with long-term risks or giving people advice, stratifying them on the basis of that activity and providing intervention and then monitoring the outcome of that. And we really need different tools for those different purposes.